Flaw with the cage system. Many guitar teachers teach the cage system like this. They say that whatever the highest fret of the chord is, that will be the lowest fret for the next caged shape. So if I'm playing a C, my highest fret is the third fret, which means it's now the lowest for my next caged shape. Rule still holds up. Rule still holds up. Still holds up, but then it falls apart here. Because for the D caged shape, my highest fret is the 13th fret. And then for the C caged shape, my lowest fret is the 12th fret. And watch what happens when we make everything minor. You're really gonna stretch this far? Gonna stretch this far? The cage system is a tool for learning, but it's not perfect. Some knowledge of chord tones is required here for preventing mistakes. Age reveal at 1 million YouTube subscribers. Now just leave!